we were the first we were the first in line for governors in the governor's race and uh, we're going to be we're going to be first the rest of the way Suburban businessman Gary Rabine today was the first Republican candidate for governor to file for the June primary election ballot. Hundreds of candidates for state and local office showed up with some rivals bumping into each other. Our political editor Mike Flannery reports. Pictures posted by a downstate reporter showed Republicans Darren Bailey and Gary Rabine talking with the man they hoped to unseat this year, Governor J.B. Pritzker as they all waited in line on the first day of filing for a spot on the June 28th ballot. We pretty well talked about the weather, so that's the uh, third face-to-face -face that I've had with Governor Pritzker. And the governor said nominating petitions he submitted held signatures from each of Illinois' 102 counties. We have support everywhere in this state for the agenda that we're standing for, and that's standing up for working families. For another Republican candidate, Aurora's Mayor Richard Irvin, this was his first day of publicly disclosed campaign events with voters. You know, I'm hearing that they, they believe crime is out of control under J.B. Prisker. Taxes and wasteful spending is out of control. Corruption is out of control. And uh, our, our residents of Illinois want, want a difference. Republicans hope that corruption issue will help them flip seats in the General Assembly, enough to end the Democrats' veto-proof supermajorities. Last week's indictment of longtime House Speaker Mike Madigan has Democrats on the defensive. Chris Welsh, who is now the Speaker, blocked any type of inquiry or any type of work to be done where the House of Representatives could have taken action to remove him much sooner. The justice system will handle that. Uh, I think that's the appropriate place for that to be addressed. Uh, the former Speaker will have his day in court. Candidates who were in line by 8 a.m. will be entered in a random drawing that will determine who gets the top spot on the ballot. I'm political editor Mike Flannery.